Hello, I'm Carol Larson, and here are the top trending stories in Green Country tonight. The Rogers County Sheriff makes an arrest in the case of a body found inside a mobile home that had been set on fire. Sheriff Walton says deputies arrested Kevin T. Foster. He's now charged with first degree murder and arson in the death of his stepfather. The sheriff says the two were supposed to be in court the day of the murder over a property dispute. One of Tulsa's popular downtown festivals won't be coming back. The Blue Dome Arts Festival won't return in 2019. Organizers say downtown's growth and new business are great for the city, but too tough on the 15-year-old event, and there just wasn't enough space anymore. For more on this story, look for Jitsal Puente's story on KJRH.com. The Oklahoma Medical Marijuana Authority has now decided not to openly publish the names and street addresses of licensed growers. Those lists were made public on October 31st, and the next day, the Norman police took a report of a home burglary where the owner claimed he was targeted because he's a registered grower. Now, the information is still available through a formal request. Change is starting to take shape tomorrow on your Saturday with a cold front coming in from the north with a wind shift to out of the north between about 10 and 20 miles per hour. So temperatures falling in throughout the mid to late afternoon hours. No precipitation expected tomorrow, but that's going to change up folks on Sunday, especially by Sunday morning. Some of that frozen precipitation, maybe some pockets of some freezing drizzle for again Sunday morning, especially north and northeast of the Tulsa metro area and those cold temperatures temperatures for the weekend. So again, today we have those highs into the 60s. That colder air comes in this weekend. Today's forecast easily into the mid 60s across the Tulsa metro area. Southeasterly winds between about 5 and 15 miles per hour. Overnight lows tonight, not as drastic from the upper 30s to right around 40 degrees. Your latest seven day forecast. So 50s for highs tomorrow. Areas of freezing drizzle by Sunday morning. The daytime high only at 42 degrees, but then nice weather for next week, warming up those temperatures 60 on Wednesday, Thanksgiving upper 50s with mostly sunny skies. All right, thanks, Brandon. And thank you for catching up with Two Works For You. We're on air at 5, 6, and 10. Also working for you on KJRH.com, on Facebook, and our mobile app.